This is your Extreme Weather Outlook for this Friday, September 27th. I'm meteorologist Daniel Kaiser. We are watching a major winter storm developing as we go into the weekend across the northern Rockies, potentially even historic for this time of year. We will also be watching record heat in the southeast and severe storms and heavy rain in the central United States. But first, we will start you off in the northwest, where starting tonight and lasting into the weekend, we will be watching a winter storm across the region, especially in the northern Rockies, bringing some very heavy snow, the potential of blizzard conditions with wind gusts over 50 miles per hour. And then behind that, as we head into next week, some record lows, especially as we head towards Tuesday morning, will be possible in Montana. But we can see that heavy snow continuing throughout the weekend across the region. We do have winter storm watches and warnings from Washington into Montana and Wyoming. Taking a look at your snowfall totals, we could see two and a half inches of snow in Missoula, but you can see that bullseye here on our map. Portions of the northern Rockies could see at least 36 to 48 inches of snow over the next few days, including 32 inches of snow in Cutbank, 46 inches of snow at St. Mary, and even eight inches of snow as you head down towards Helena. And we will also be watching those strong wind gusts potentially causing blizzard conditions across the region as we head through the weekend. Now across the southeast, we saw record highs on Thursday, including Charlotte, Atlanta, Birmingham, down towards Mobile and Jacksonville. Even a few areas saw 100 degree record highs, including 102 in Macon, 100 in Montgomery. Today, we could see record highs from the Gulf Coast all the way up towards Louisville and Lexington, including Nashville, Atlanta, Birmingham, and in Mobile as well. Meanwhile, we are watching that heavy rain threat across the central U.S. with one to three inches of rain possible through 7 p.m. on Sunday. We are also watching the severe storm threat as we go throughout the day today.